Uh, I was just tired of it. I was tired of trying to hide it for them. I felt like it all might come back on me or some of my other coworkers, and I just wanted to be done with it. It was a tough spot to be in. This former movie theater manager says he collected paperwork for the IRS to prove his boss, Elaine Dawson, was not being truthful about the finances at her five theaters across northern Michigan. We have uh, daily reports that we fax to them at the end of the night with all the numbers, all the reports, whatever. And uh, when they would come into the theater saying, oh, we're down for the month, we're down for the month, um, and I have all these numbers that are saying we're up X amount, you know, so where's all this missing money? He says he gave the IRS eight years worth of documents that show she only reported a portion of her income from ticket sales, popcorn, soda, and gift cards. <laughs> Records filed Tuesday in Grand Rapids Federal Court show Dawson plans to plead guilty to tax evasion. The court documents say she tried to evade part of the taxes she owed by regularly under-reporting the number of patrons who had bought tickets to view movies at her cinemas and took out the cash from the unreported. The unpaid taxes totaled almost a million dollars. We tried to contact Dawson, but our calls went unanswered. The whistleblower says he's surprised she's the only person that's been charged by the feds. They paid everything in cash, houses, boats, cars, every year, and they never had any regard for their workers, their company. They would never take care of their company first before they take care of themselves.